With Halloween fast approaching, now is a good time to go over the design of a laser vortex. They're easy to build and pretty cheap to make. They have three main components, a laser, a mirror, and an electric motor to spin the mirror. You want to position your laser in a way that it's not interfering with the circle that you're projecting. If you get it too high, you'll have a break in the bottom of your circle. When you're pointing the laser, you need to point it towards the center of the mirror. If you get it too far one way or the other, then your circle will be misshapen. I've attached my laser using nylon ties. I left the bottom one a little loose so that I could slip it over the top of the on-off button on the laser pointer. For my motor, I'm using a case fan out of a computer. I've also, on the back, mounted a camera mount for a tripod. That way I can easily adjust the height and the angle of the unit when I have it set up. On mine, I've attached a plug-in for a 9-volt battery to my case fan. That way I can use it without having to have power run to anything. It cuts down on the amount of cords I have out in the yard. If you don't want to go that route, they do make AC adapters specifically for case fans for computers. These are about $12 on Amazon. If you don't have a case fan, you have some old toys laying around, you can use the electric motor out of the old toy. They work just as well. They're a little harder to attach the mirror to, but with a little trial and error you can get that. So this is my basic design. And I guess the only thing left to do is to try it out.